there's been a crackdown in Canoga Park and other communities around Los Angeles. The latest report from the LA City Metro shows that one out of every four riders on the Orange Line is taking a free ride. Most of the time I pay, but it's just a tax, like $3 every time trying to go somewhere. So I don't really, I probably pay like every other time. Metro officials say the thousands of ferry baiters cost the citywide transportation agency close to $2 million annually. The issue really is that, uh, that we have a service that's of value and it's important for people to pay the fare. Uh, the gasoline has to be bought for, uh, for the buses and the bus drivers have to be paid. And you know the, the infrastructure has to, be, has to be kept up. The buses have to be maintained. And all that is paid for by the fares. The point of the Orange Line, which runs from Chatsworth to North Hollywood, is to get Metro passengers on board and to their destinations quickly. There are no gates to pass through to expedite the process, but the transportation agency entrusts riders to do their part and tap their passes so the appropriate fare can be deducted before they get on the bus. Really, I don't be feeling like paying. Really, I just don't want to pay. I don't think that's fair. That some people don't pay their like fare for the bus and just get on. But you know, I guess they get their karma. And they get like a ticket or something. Two hundred dollars compared to one fifty. The crackdown means that more sheriff's deputies will be patrolling Metro Orange Line stations. This, in turn, means they will be writing more tickets. Deputies will be at stations to make sure riders have valid tap passes. So if you don't have it, you're busted. Just $1.50 and one tap of this card will save you hundreds of dollars in LA City and Metro fees. I'm Erica Roberson at Canoga Park Metro Station, Valley Union.